field has been expanded to 72,000, and two weeks ago, they exceeded that. They had over 73,000 for Southern Cal. We're at the number seven on the right, so it's Hampton. Deep along with John L. Williams, we are set for four football in Gainesville, Florida. The kick and the game is underway. He bounces out at the 35. More to kick. A shorter kick coming down the middle this time. Lorenzo Hampton has it at about the 11-yard line. He's got a hole. He gets up near the 30-yard line. Before. Dixon and Jackson are the wide receivers. He's throwing quickly. It's completed to 30. Out at the 35 is your eye on him. Second down, about four and a half yards to go for Florida. Straight ahead. Jones has the first down, banging out to the 46-yard line. Read of the block. One-on-one -on -one blocks. You can see them all just firing out at their opponent across the line of scrimmage. Jones does a great job of reading. Yard line, Florida moving from their own 30. Hampton and Jones are the running backs. This is Jones again as he cracks over right tackle. Picks up two. Hampton now splits to the right. He's in the slot on the right side. And there's 13 minutes, 49 seconds to play first quarter here in Gainesville. The Gators with the football. Peace will pass. Caught right at midfield. That's Dixon. This is marvelous execution. Good protection. I thought for a moment that we were going to get a rush from Jackson. Peace moves up in the pocket, though. Throws. Dixon's cutting across high in the air. Makes a reception. Pays a price for it. He had the football ball at the 50-yard line. Third down, six. Sideline passes complete to number 80. Chris have done a great job so far for Florida. Look at the punt return average, only 2.6. They've been high, long kicks. And the man back deep. Again, no return on this kick. It'll be flagged first and 10 at the 30 for the Bulldogs. Now you'll see the wishbone as they set it up. A fumble on the first play. Bond picks it up. He's tackled behind the line. When you get this kind of conditions, it's very, very difficult. Uh, the ball slipped out. Uh, no one really mishandled. The ball was just too slippery to hang on to. Bond tried to pick it up and do something with it, but uh, no. An offensive line from Mississippi. ESPN. Mississippi State has a good record there, three and one. These two teams have split their last four games. Coming back the other way, number 22, Danny Knight. Gets close to the original line of scrimmage. No score here, 11 minutes and 26 seconds to play first quarter. We'll see if John Bond goes to the air. He does not. He goes straight ahead. Running with the football is Coons, who's now in the lineup. And Coons... You see it up the middle. You can see the close down. Beautiful block on the linebacker. Coons makes a nice break to the outside as he gets a block from Haddix. And that was a big first down. Third down and a little more than 10. Haddix and Wansley, the other running backs. This is Wansley. He gets outside. 182 in the air. Second down play. Quarterback with the bat, with the football. He's got another first down as he gets down to about 40 to 70. We'll take another look at This is the option, as you can see. The fake to the fullback, and then the fullback leading to block. Red by Bond very well. He cuts upfield, breaks outside, getting a very nice block that time from Price. And ball at the 42-yard line. Corwin Aldridge in the game, along with Jerry Price, straight ahead to the fullback. Al Ricky. You see the fire out. Beautiful block that time by Hull. Being helped also in there by Harris. Good drive. Excellent. Minutes, 20 seconds to play in the first quarter. Wansley with it, and he's wrapped up. State driving. 9.45 to play first quarter. No score. Bond throwing quickly. It's incomplete. Intended for Glenn Young. Is the leading career punter. Kicking toward the sideline. Ivory Curry will not make a run right here on ESPN. First and 10 at the 8. James Jones. At the 10 to about the 12. All time rushing categories for the Gators. James Jones has it again. More yardage across the 15, close to the 20 yard. Again, he's as good a fullback as he's in the country. Simply straight ahead blocking with him reading the blocks, finding the daylight, and then using his strength. He's 6'3, 227 half hole. It is a first down. Ball just short of the 20 yard line. Peace throwing. Pass is complete. That's Mike Malarkey, the tight end. He's out. Who plays. And Jones has been carrying the football. There's a beautiful fake to Jones and a marvelous throw by Peace. Receiver is wide open. Malarkey looked like he might go even further. Michigan State or Mississippi State's. Back as Emory Ballard paces the sidelines. Jones, nice hole up the middle. He gets across the 45. This is now the fullback. The tailback is John L. Williams. 
This is Daryl Williams right at the line of scrimmage. He's banged down. That's a seven. Wayne Peace with over 366 yards passing coming into this game. That one is incomplete. Intended for some job. He brought one back all the way for a touchdown against Florida last year. Let's see what he does with this one. He'll let it bounce at the 20. And it's down state at the 20. Spinning forward. Afternoon. Second down, eight. Straight ahead. The fullback, Al UPI. Mississippi State number 17, according to UPI. Bond with the football. He'll keep it and turn it upfield. First down as he moves across the 35. Bond opens up. There's the first fake. Kuntz leading for him. The corner man is up, waiting for the pitch to Haddix. Bond simply keeps the football, turns upfield for the first down. Also has scored one running touchdown this year. He's thrown for three. Looking downfield. Now he throws his complete as he runs out of bounds. Second possession of the afternoon. Fullback straight ahead. Out. Emory Ballard, former Texas A&M coach, looking on. Again, the fullback straight ahead to about five. Ball at the 40-yard line of Florida. Mississippi State moving. Bond still has it. First down inside the third. And we get an unnecessary rough. Bond keeps the ball on the option. Fake to the fullback. Right it to the outside. You can see Kuntz making a nice block on the safety man coming up. That was it. The hand on the face guard. He called face guard. Oh, five to play first quarter. He's got a chance. Spinning inside is George Wansley. Second down nine. Ball at the 15. Bond still has the football. It's the ball to Wansley here, but you can see Wansley loses the relationship he has with the quarterback. He thinks Bond is going to keep it, so he cuts up here, and as Bond is ready to toss the ball off to him. He's standing right next to him, so he didn't have any real option on the play. Third down, 11 for Mississippi State. Lose the football. Scramble for it. Kick comes from about the 37-yard line. It's good. Good kick. Williams in the end zone about two yards. 15-20, a little room as he goes to the 20 came on to become the quarterback when Bob Huco got hurt. A little bit of running in that time for Lorenzo. It's 3-0. James Jones trying to get outside. Can't do it. First quarter. Third down, five. Hampton. He will not get outside. He's tackled for a big loss. Gets it away. It's a good roll inside the 40 to the 35 yard line where the ball at the 36 first down Mississippi State and it's straight ahead. Al Ricky Edwards the fullback. Bond with the pitch this time to Wansley. Wansley gets Grover Marshall. He doesn't have enough experience on his defensive line to do that. Bond turns it. He's got a first down. Bond tried to set up the ladder there by cutting upfield. Bond with the pitch. That's Wyndham. Gets away from one man. Moves across midfield. Loses. A lot of agreement from the fans, but I think the decision was right. There's the pick to Kuntz. A little bit of a bobble there. And the tackle comes in. Bond pitches the ball. Wamsley breaks one tackle. And those are the things that drive you goofy when you're coaching the defense. You've got the play stopped, and you miss a tackle, and it picks up. up for the first time this afternoon. The Bulldogs leading the Gators. Straight ahead running. That is Wyndham for the 40-yard line. 13 minutes, 15 seconds to go first half. Almost a bad handle by the quarterback. Second and nine at the 38. There's the pitch. Wyndham. This is what they want to do. Third and two. Bond turns it upfield. He's got the first down. Oh, in the first half. From behind. 22 unassisted tackles going into this game. You can see him coming from the far side. Nobody blocks him because he's a linebacker. Bond reading out in front. Doesn't feel him coming, and he's caught from behind. 11 minutes, 15 seconds to play first half. The rush is on. He gets the football. Quiet, which he won't get. 
Straight back. They got him under pressure. Football. High snap. Moore will kick it. Trying to drop it inside the five. It rolls into the end. 20 yard line. Wayne Peace looks to put it in the air. Dumps it too long for Jones. Jackson, the wide receivers. Jones is the fullback. He's got the ball straight ahead. Good running room for James Jones as he rambles out near the 28 yard. Very good blocking by Bromley. Hunt, fight, showpiece. Very good read. And then Jones is just too much power, too much strength. He runs through Nichols. Nichols hangs on to bring him down. Hampton in motion. Straight ahead is Jones. First down for the Gators. He busted. This time Jones is set in the slot. They go straight ahead to the tailback. That is Lorenzo talking about. You see them take off. They're beating the Mississippi State lineman to the punch. Green comes in, able to maintain his balance and get through to be in on the tackle, but it was Clark split off. Also, Daryl Williams, two fullbacks in there. Wayne Peace will keep it, and he'll lose a yard. Full numbers. Here it is again. You can see Peace rolling. He wants to throw the football, can't, twists, gets away. And there's that was the face mask. John L. Williams is now the tailback. Jones, the fullback. Peace throwing quickly, got a man open at the 45 yard line. Spencer Jackson. Check the penalty. James Jones. Looking for running room, gets outside across the 40, near the 44 yard line. Before. Didn't really have much here. A draw usually goes up inside. You can see it there with the draw play. There's nothing inside as he starts up. That little juke he took inside, though, set everybody up for him. He takes it to the outside. He's got more speed than the state defensive men who are trying to close on him. Turn the corner to the outside. Picked up 11 yards on the track of that as we go along. Second down, nine. Hampton, the tailback. Good move by Lorenzo to get close to me. Hampton and Jones are the running backs. They are split behind Peace, who will look downfield. Now he tries to turn it upfield. Rush from the outside. Call the option pass run here, but he doesn't get any daylight outside as Jackson moves in. He could not throw the ball. The receiver was covered. He had to try. Mississippi State is leading by three. Sybil adjusting a little bit to get off a nice kick. And it hits a Mississippi State man. At the five-yard line, the ball is loose. It's in the end zone. Race for it. The Bulldogs have it. Game that we'll be naming a little bit later on. Now Ricky Edwards to five. Second down, seven. Bond. Across the 25 to the... Everybody does try to close. It's uh, very legal to make the tackle. Bond looking, has to cut back inside. He doesn't have the ball put away very well. And now the entire Florida defense closes. State 41 to 17. Next week, they'll play Georgia at home. Now Ricky Edwards does not have the first down. Jump. End over end kick. Curry takes it at the 31. At the 35, that's about it. He tries to get away, cannot. Sanders and Bud Wilkinson, the score remains. Mississippi State Bulldogs three and the Florida Gators nothing. Let's go back now to Florida Field in Gainesville. So Florida, this is John Sanders along with Bud. Downs are concerned. It's kind of what we expected at uh, Florida. to Mississippi State. For both teams. The Gators kick it off into the end zone and he will bring it out. Ganey's kickoff goes to Young. And Young, a bit moving into the slot. Price and Young are the ends. That's the fullback, Al Ricky Edwards, as he gets across the field. Bond with the football. Now the pitch down the sideline and run out of bounds as Michael. First time when you're backed up on the 11 yard line, you're about to lose field position. Misdirection that time by the fullback. And then the execution of the option play, absolutely perfectly done by Bond. Haddock turns upfield, appears as though he might be able to jump high enough to find some clearance downfield, but he trips over his own man, first down. At the 34 with 13.59 to go third quarter. Now Ricky Edwards dives straight ahead, about six. Haddock gets into the... Bond. 
Everybody gambling. You can see how close the Florida defenders are. They have all 11 of them playing run this time, and they guessed right. They got one more man, and they block. Good kick. Curry calls fair catch and skids into the end zone. James Jones, the fullback, number 30. Little mix up in the backfield. John L. Williams has it, and he gets outside to the 35 yard line before the defense playing some attention to him. And he didn't go on the right side of the quarterback time or the correct side. However, Peace had grace presence of mind, went right ahead and executed the option play. Halfback is outside, turning upfield. It leads. You can see how much water is still on, still on the field from the rain we had in the first half. And once again, Williams close to another first down. The team that lives on the option. It's the play the way it should have been run the last time. That time Jones went by on the correct side. And the pitch is out. Williams turns it up the field and has enough drive to pick up the first down. Quick first down for the Gators. John L. Williams again cuts it back inside. Gets another four yards on the play. 56 to go third quarter. Peace will keep the football. Going to be short of a first. Jones is 30. Williams is 22. Straight drop back on third down. Pass is complete. Making the catch is Dwayne Dixon at the 40-yard line. For Mechanical execution here. The receiver simply drives downfield. Drives the corner man back. And it's right on target. An offensive line did a good job that time, Bud, to keep him out of there. Yeah. This drive, they've moved rather quickly downfield here with 9.55 to play third quarter. This is Jones straight ahead. Bouncing down. What's the line drive off? That's the short side. Brown Schulten, he's there. You do great jobs of blocking. And Jones cuts it back inside after the strong side of the line created the Ola open. doing a good job along that line. It's second down three. Ball at the 33. Jones battling to get to the one. They pack it in. First down, John L. Williams. Football player, great blocker. Let's watch him here. Driving inside. He's taking on the linebacker one-on-one -on -one and absolutely destroying him. That was George, the tackle, not the linebacker. Kristen Tam, good drive by the Gators. A lot of it on the ground. Jones trying to get outside. Does inside the 25, down to the 21-yard line. Billy J LSU will come to Florida Field. Here's John L. Williams. He squirts through to manage to pick up a couple backs behind Peace. It's third and two. Peace with the football. He's got a first down. Loses the ball now. Pile up at the 12 yard line. We'll wait for the signal. The officials indicate that the end you can see is coming so tight inside that Peace, who was expecting to option off him, runs around him. He does a great job of keeping his balance. The ball is put away fairly well, but you can see it's stripped there. It bounces around. Scramble. The white shirts of Mississippi State. Bond makes the pitch. They don't care where they run the option. They're sure of how they do it. Fake to the fullback. The pitch. It's right on target. The corner man is absolutely free. Makes a tackle. But Haddock. And so Young and Knight are the wide receivers. Straight ahead is Haddock. Committing very solidly, as you can see. Everyone forcing the play. Their linebackers are forcing it. The safety men are coming almost with the snap. You got every gap filled. It's very. He's going to throw. Goes downfield. Closest man. The fullback Edwards is blowing the clouds out of here, but he's going to put some pressure on the kicker. Hangs it up a little bit. Ball will bounce on the Mississippi State side of the 50-yard line inside the third quarter. This is John Sanders along with Bud Wilkinson. Peace to pass on first down. Looking deep. He's got a man down the middle. That Spencer Jackson falls down. Flag on the play. You can see the inattentional tangling up of the feet there. Receiver knocked ground. Number 44. In motion is John L. Williams. Jones. To the six. John L. Williams to the five. Maybe well, it's much cooler than that this afternoon. The rain has stopped. John L. Williams. Touchdown, Florida. Able to make it again. Simply the quick cross play outside. 
Williams with the ball. Jones once again just running through the people. You can see the marvelous agility that Williams has as he keeps his feet before. Thank you. Al E. Gator. This time he will not come out. It's the fullback. The halfbacks are Haddocks and Wansley. It's Wansley. Not much there. A couple of years. Bomb throwing after the fake. The pass is complete to Jerry Price. And Price is up for 31 yards. Bond still has the football. A little seam in the defense. How wet it is. The field drains quite well. There's the inside fake. Bond coming off the inside fake. He's got the option man, Haddox, trailing. He turns upfield, out of bounds, and then he's in. Helped him pick up seven yards on the play. Now has 27 yards in the game. In the backfield, that one's going to be stopped. Down about four. Pass play, threw it away. A lot of contact. Let's take a look. You can we'll see if we can see the bump from the end zone. There's the triple option fake. And you could see him being hit there very hard before the ball was even close to him. Bond down the line of scrimmage and from behind. Once again, it's Marshall again coming from the far side. See the sharp, short angle that he takes. Bond doesn't expect to get any trouble from that side, but it's the second time in the game. Marks and penalties in that game. This is second down eight. Bond, under some pressure, rolls away, looks downfield, throws deep. Going to be out of bounds. And to make the Mississippi State side of the field all the way. Bond. Passes incomplete. And it's third down. Long, long yard. Pass is complete for the 45. Glenn for Mississippi State. It's still a very big play for Mississippi State because it gives them a chance to kick the ball and put Florida back deep. A very good reception by Young. The ball was kind of wobbly, but he moved back. Hard line. From the end zone, we'll see the kick get away. He takes it and is hit immediately at the 13-yard line. There's the freshman again. John L. Williams gets outside. Close to a first. Of James Jones, number 30, the fullback. Williams again. Peace throwing to Williams. Spins away from one man, then he's dropped. Now they shift into a pro set. Peace straight back. Has some time looking downfield for Gary Roll. He's got it. Good job of picking up the blitz. You can see the blitz coming. You see Jones moving in. You also see Hampton moving in to protect the passer. That gives Pierce time to throw the ball. It's always one-on-one -on -one when you are rushing the passer. It's a perfect throw to roll. And a big, big first down for the University of Florida. And Phil Bo two. Roll is a transfer from Army. Playing for the Gators, and he's got him in a good spot. Now Jones gets away and gets up to about the and five seconds to play in the game. Second down nine for Florida. Reverse. Here comes Tyrone Young. Young's got some room. At the 25, he's run out of bounds. Very good adjustment to the attack. You can see the quarterback piece going back to be the lead blocker on the play. It appears that they've got reasonably good position, but the Mississippi State contained man do a good job of moving to the outside. Won't let him turn the corner. They get too young. Knock him out of bounds. Third down and two. Freshman dive. Good offensive line charge, as you can see. And again, a gorgeous block by Jones. He just neutralized. The Gators have the ball at the 21. Quick pass. Williams inside the 15 to the 14 yard line. In the football, and this is just a movement. If you're keying the fullback, it didn't look like Jones did much to them, but as well, he's, he's carried the ball. You freeze the linebackers. This time, Peace will keep it. Back. Seven to three, the score. And breaks loose down at the th touchdown. What's the marvelous blocking here? Hampton hits it straight up the middle and takes it to the outside. As you saw, Jones just absolutely destroyed Green, making it just pure daylight. Hampton almost scored on the play. Both Williams in there right now. 
And it's the freshman, Williams, getting down. Ball at the two. Hampton diving. Well, the defensive line has got to be low. There is a great block there by Hunt. Up and over the top into the end zone. You know, the other thing, Bud, that this doesn't do anymore. The extra point is perfect. Short kick. And Florida is after it. With 11-18 to play in the football game. This kick is better. It'll come down the center of the field to George Young at the 10-yard line. Oh, what a hit. Now you notice they move their backs out a little bit. Haddix and Wamsley. Loose football. Marshall has it for Florida. Very, very bad time from the standpoint of Mississippi State. There's a the quick pitch. The ball is mishandled. Marshall, of course, causing it all in. Now Jones getting a little bit of a break. Loose football. We'll see who gets that one. Back top of him. Second down. 12. Quick pass. Complete. Bouncing inside to the... Very good execution of the quick passers. Again, Jones coming over the ball. A quick throw. Catch everybody moving a little bit the wrong way. Jones and Hampton, the running backs. Out of the eye formation. Hampton. Down to the two-yard line. First down, Gators. Bobby Junkin made the tackle. Marvelous job of blocking. Watch the offensive line block. There's Jones driving the linebacker out. Hampton finding. Hampton diving in. Combination by Florida. Again, the beautiful blocking and up, up, up in the air and over. But you can still Ganey with the extra point. Squibs it off to the right, and it's no good. Quickly within a span of a couple of minutes here in the fourth quarter. And all of a sudden, Florida is very much in control. Right at the 30 yard line. Bond throwing downfield, pass complete. Dan Got it again. There's a quick fake to the fullback, and the throw to the end coming in on the slant pattern. He was wide open, almost slipped away from the tacklers for a long. The 47, first and 10. Clock running, just over nine minutes to play in the game. Bond will throw again. Complete. Again, it's Danny. They've got that play. Haddix. Oh. Bond will throw. Down the middle intended for Knight. He's got a touchdown. Mississippi State is on the board. Watch it again. Everybody blocking for him. And he feels the pressure coming right there. Makes an absolutely perfect throw to Knight. He's got just a little more speed than the defensive safety man running the post pattern. And it's a easy to booms it through there with the wind. In. And Dana Moore will kick it off. Drives it out of the end zone and split to the bottom of the screen. Hampton has the football. He's got some room outside. Across the 25 to the 27 yard line. A bounce to stop the clock. We'll keep an eye on it because it could be a factor. Jones, first down, Florida. Yards. He's the fullback. Right behind Wayne Peace. There's the tailback. Hampton. He gets outside again. To the 40. Midfield. Down the still free. He turns it back to the center of the field. He is going to score. Lorenzo Hampton. Answer the touchdown of Mississippi State. Gaining this tight offense. Watch the tailback, number seven. See him starting inside, then breaking outside. And once again, Jones just eliminates the linebacker. But Hampton shakes off the tackle there of Nichols, turns down the sidelines. He's almost on that chalk mark. It looks as though he'll be stopped right there. That was Lambert coming across, but he's too strong for him. Then we got a good block as he reversed his field and now it is all over. Spencer Jackson through the last block this quarter. We still have a little over seven minutes to go. At the five, it's Glenn Young. Does not get back. So now it's up to Bond once again. Quick pass. It is complete again to Danny. Just the quick drop back. Fullback coming over the ball. Bond on target. Low pass. Knight goes to the ground, makes a splendid reception. Yard pick up, first down 10. Intercepted. 
That's Fred McAllister, number four. Florida is doing here. Bond gets a little bit of pressure, but not a lot. He just kind of forced it. And he hit back. Anderson, another freshman, is the tailback, and he has the ball. And he goes almost nowhere. Ehrman watching some other college teams play. Again, the freshman, Anderson. Anderson again. And they stretch it out, string him out. He gets the kick away. Just barely. He hit the thing in the football game. First down 10 at the 27 for Mississippi State. Bond dumps it off to George Wansley. Wansley still on his feet as he gets inside, outside the 40-yard line. Bond's pass is incomplete. Only three minutes, 57 seconds remaining in the game. Bond goes deep. The Florida defender ran into the LSU comes to Florida field. For Mississippi State, Georgia at home next week. Bond's pass is again in. Offensive attack for Florida. He is our Vitalis player of the game. Our congratulations to him. In and when you're off to the start, they are going to be very hard to beat. Huco is the quarter. Three minutes exactly remaining. Huco, a left-hander. Throws downfield, incomplete. Back again, let's see, this will be, I think, their ninth straight victory here at home. That's Neil Anderson. Good pressure, but Sybil gets it off. It rolls just into the end. Good start. Bond down the middle, his pass is complete. Knight can break it. He's going to go all the way for a Mississippi State touchdown. He got away from Ricky Eastman. Here. Simple post pattern again. Bond has the ball right on target. Knight makes a little bit of an inside break. And usually when you're carrying the ball, you don't outrun the defenders the way he does here. He's got remarkable speed. Well, Tony Lilly, number 18 from Woodbridge, you see him give up along with Ivory Curry. No second touchdown catch of the game. He has three for the year. To the left side. There's the kick. The Gators surround it. <laughs> <laughs> the uh, more time in the, in the next four possessions. And as that was happening, Jones fighting for the yardage. The team can contain the kick return man, Glenn Young in this case. Loose football, Mississippi State on the move. He can't advance the ball. That is Frankie Brown. Low snap. Ball not able to be handled, and they had 10 men coming. And the 10 man rush effectively was there to recover the fumble. Bond for Knight. He's got him inside the 25 at the 23 yard line. Beat him. Bond's got him again. This time. Capacity to get rid of him. He's very well covered on this play, as you can see. He's got everybody closing on him, and Bond forced it in there. There was no chance of. At the play, 59 seconds remaining. Bond in the end zone, incomplete. Here. The pass is dumped off to the back. Wyndham, who is out of bounds, to the bottom of the screen. Bond with 258 yards passing now. Dumps it over the middle, incomplete, in and out of the hands. Three. They'll simply take this to ten. But Mike was not through. An 80-yard touchdown pass from Bond made it 27 to 17. That's our final dogs. First